Good morning lovelies. I hope you are keeping safe and well. Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who I haven't met before, I'm Emma Ryder, Psychic Medium and Divine Channeler and today is the Twin Flame reading. So just a little bit of admin to begin with. I do believe time is fluid and you will receive the guidance you need to know at just the right time for you, whether that is today or in three weeks time. I also read mainly what the Divine Masculine is bringing through the space there at the messages they have for the Divine Feminine. I do understand I have a lot of Divine Masculines watching. So if you feel that it resonates with you to switch the DM for the DF, then please do so. Follow your heart and go with what resonates with you. Okay. And songs seem to be massively important at the minute about bringing messages through from the Divine Masculine about your path. And I've been humming a song and you'll know I'm not very good at songs, but I get the lyrics. So I thought I would Google it before I came on OK. And it's Dido, Do You Have A Little Time? If you're feeling low and lost today, you're probably doing too much again. You spend all your hours just rushing around. Do you have a little time? Do you have a little time for me? Okay. <coughs> and if you're feeling stressed, just try calling. Okay, and that, that last lyrics really felt important because it was like, the Divine Masculine, the beginning of the song, is telling you, you need to slow down, you need to look after yourself, you need to not, like, be stressing so much, rushing so much. You actually need to look after you because you are very important. But then, and if you're feeling stressed, just try calling. I really want to say to you, Divine Feminine, if you are feeling the urge, the inspiration, guided, whichever word you would like to use, to call your Divine Masculine, now is the time. And if you've been wondering whether it's the right thing to do, this is your sign you've been waiting for. Now is the time to call. And what feels really important, and this might sound really, really random, but I really feel like a phone conversation is going to be worth so, so much more than a text, email, whatever like that. And I know a phone conversation isn't available to everybody because some of you don't have contact details. But for those of you that do, I really do feel picking up the phone and making that connection is really so, so important today. It feels very like the Divine Masculines which are sending this message through are in a state of needing support and needing the confirmation from you that you're like, you're still talking to them, you're still connected to them. You aren't not talking to them because they've hurt you, because they've acted stupid. It almost feels like your Divine Masculine needs your reassurance today. And it's not very often they ask for that. But it does feel very much like, just let me know that we're okay. Because I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the things I've said. I'm sorry for the way I've acted. I'm sorry for the things I've done. I know you know Divine Feminine. It wasn't personal. It was because of the situation I was in. Please forgive me. And because they're asking for forgiveness, because they're unsure of how you're feeling about how they acted or what they've done or what they've said, it feels like it is a barrier holding them back in some respects. So I know Sometimes reaching out to your Divine Masculine is scary, is probably not what you would say. I know I'll be met with a lot of people saying, I can't possibly do that because they did this and they did that. 
but you're bigger than that energy. You are more compassionate. You're more empathic than that. If you truly love your divine masculine unconditionally, you will pick up that phone and show them the support and love they need today. Even if it is met with not much communication back, they know you care, they know you're there, they know you're sending support. And that does really feel like so important. And I'm just looking down at my iPad screen where I was reading the lyrics to the Dido song and love and compromise is there which has come up in the search results but is totally by a different artist and isn't one I feel is linked to what I was receiving but the love and compromise feels really important because you love your divine masculine your divine masculine loves you and your divine masculine is asking you to compromise just a little. To compromise and stop waiting but show them support. Open up the communication lines the other way today. It does feel very... I do feel the resistance I'm being met with by many of the watchers. But those who have been drawn to contact the Divine Masculine over the last few days are going to welcome this message with open arms because it is their sign that that is what they need to do and that is what they need to do to move their journey forwards. Don't be stubborn. It's about give and take, compromise and unconditional love. No matter what, you love your twin flame. So show them the support they need at the moment. I've just dropped a card. So let's have a look at the cards. <laughs> and when this communication, there's always the hummingbird. Stop running and communicate. That is what I want to say. Stop running and communicate or run towards your divine masculine and communicate. It feels like quite, it's a message from your divine masculine, like they're waiting for communication, but it feels also a direct message to the divine feminine. And know this will bring about transformation and miracles. It's going to bring about that feminine in tune side of the transformation which is needing to happen as your divine masculine is opening up to those emotions which he has been for the past few days support him let him know you're there you can't do the work for him but if he knows you're there it's going to help him and we've also got the nightingale card it's definitely definitely a time to communicate today it's going to move things forwards so much and it is going to give your divine masculine the knowledge, the confirmation they need to push forwards and move further towards you. Oh, it's quite deep from the divine masculine today, isn't it? Let's have a look at the universe message card now. See what light they can shed. Obstacles are detours in the right direction. You are being detoured to communicate with your Divine Masculine. Trust it. Know it's the right thing to do. And it's moving you in the right direction. Thank you so very much for joining me, everybody. Please do like and comment on the video if you feel drawn. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. It's truly appreciated. Thank you to each and every one of you for supporting me on this journey. I am truly grateful I can be a part of your journey. I love connecting with people via the videos on a one-to-one -one personal level. I absolutely love hearing everybody's stories of transformation, of union, 
each part of the journey. So thank you for allowing me to do this work. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Have a fabulous day and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Take care, stay safe. Namaste. Bye.